Welcome, Collective. This is your girl, the Spiritual Assassin. Welcome to my page, The Cognitive Queen. I hope you guys are having a great afternoon, a great weekend. So today's read, we are doing energy pull on... We are at Aquarius now, so we're going to go ahead and tap into those energies. Remember, take what resonate, disregard the rest. And I do jump around on... on different timelines here so just take like i said what resonate and disregard the rest i do say things like he and she because of the face value of the card um remember to to um flip those parts around as you see fit for your situation if you guys need a private reading um to get a more include a exclusive look in your situation you can reach me at create creative illuminations on Facebook under my business page, or you can reach me at creativeilluminations.net and um, uh, look at look at the other services that I do provide there as well. So without further delay, let's go ahead and tap into these messages. Let's see. So we have the strength card here. I could be talking to someone that's a Leo. And on the other part of the deck, there's a king of a knight of pentacles here. So this person could be this Knight of Pentacles energy. You're about to come across money or you do uh, have uh, some type of abundance coming towards you. Yeah, you could be this strong individual person, this person, this Leo energy who I'm picking up. I see the camel as a symbolic as spiritual animal. So some of you guys may be, be um, connecting with the uh, camel spirit. I know they represent um, wealth. Um, prosperity is what I'm picking up. Also, I had angel numbers 777 and 711. So somebody is most definitely um, coming across some type of um, uh, <laughs> uh, pinnacles here. Yeah, I see that somebody went through a tower moment here. Someone that took a, a leap of faith uh, to a, a, with a new direction. They took a new a leap of faith. But they're going through a tower moment with whoever they took this leap of faith with, this 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 leap of this new journey with. They travel with somebody do it, to a new journey, down a new journey, you know. Um, and maybe going through some type of rough situations right now is what I'm picking up. The reason why I'm saying that because I'm looking at the devil card right here. Yeah, somebody uh, got in a relationship with the devil. Uh, they found out this person was uh, not the truth, that this person told nothing but lies. And this person um, basically was not who they said that they was. Yeah, your person is going through a bunch of anxiety right now, mental conflict right now, nightmares and night tears. Yeah, and they had to end it with this person right here. This person kept them in their head at night. Yeah, your person uh, dealt with a page of pentacles energy, a uh, Aries Leo Sage energy. I didn't mean to say that. I meant to say... Um, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer energy. I feel like your person could have took an offer or they gave an offer out. Let's see. Yeah, they gave the offer to someone who had a lot of options here, guys. I want you to see this. So they gave their offer to a, to someone that had a lot of options. They had to bring death to that situation because this person kept them stuck in their head. They realized this person wasn't the truth and they realized that they was tied to the devil. Yeah. This could be someone in a King of Swords energy, somebody who's very harsh, very manipulative and nasty with their mouth. He has found out or she or your partner has found out whether if it's a masculine or feminine, you already know what time it is. You have found out that this person was um, un, un, um, was not illuminated, was not the way, was not the light, was not uh, the right path to take now is what I'm picking up. You offered her or him this gift right here, some type of... Um, coinage some type of new beginning some type of new endeavor some type of i want to say new beginning you was gifted with something and you gave it to her i feel like the universe had gifted you with something the ace of pentacles is something that the most high give you you could have came across something and you and you turned around and gave it to this damn devil and that's why you're going through karma yeah you gave it to this queen of pentacles right here this Queen of Pentacles could have offered you, could have told you, ooh, so this Queen of Pentacles could have 
offered you some type of money, but this person was being deceptive about it. You was in the dark about this person. This person was actually nasty and cruel towards you. And this person was the devil. This person kept you left in your lock, locked up in your head. Kept, kept you locked in your head. You had to end this situation. And you went back to her. You gave her this, um, you could have, you gave her whatever you could out your situation, but she could have had more money than you. So y'all teamed up, but this person was not truthful with this whole connection. She was not the, she was not being truthful. You came in with your, you came in with your, your coin. She came in with her coin and y'all supposed to have built and got this big coin, but that didn't work. You found out that she had a lot of options. You guys was in love with each other or you, you guys was in a relationship. Yeah, this person was always in your ear nagging, nagging you with the five of swords. This Aries Leo Sag energy here. This is someone who kept you in a, a bunch of setback and delays. You decided to walk away from this person with the Ten of Wands energy. And you was married to the, this person with the Four of Wands energy. Or was in a committed long relationship. Yeah, you thought this person was going to have um, your back. Possibly thought this person was... Um, Maybe you was running at the material things. You thought this, this you thought that child was gonna generate this money together or get this money together, but she wasn't finna get no money. She was trying to get all the money from you and leave. Nine of Pentacles. She was in for a short time, not a long time. I, I look at nights people as who are only stopping by. They're not there for a long time. She could have had this money, could have helped you out for a little bit, or you could have been goddamn giving her a lot of money, and she was about to leave anyway. Damn, I felt like she was giving you money because she came in with this big pinnacle. You only had your little bit. Shit. She, maybe she was coming in to control you or some shit. Control your money. Control your time. Control what you do. She was obsessed over you because this is the devil energy here. So you signed a contract with the devil. This Aquarian energy. Damn. You thought she was a damn light, but she was opposite from the light. She ain't nothing but straight darkness. Damn. And I do believe in the dark side now, but I believe in balancing out both sides. Now, you got the balance. Period. Everything has to have a balance. I got the three of wands here. So this person is not uh, is not, is not going to let you go. They're not going to let you go. Yeah, because this person still love you. Even though they did this crazy ass shit to you, they still love you. You could be ready to walk away from this situation because you're not in love with this person anymore. Hmm. Yeah. I feel like that you're walking away from this love affair because you're, there's no flirtation being built here. Everything that you put that y'all touch is turning to motherfucking rust, not gold. Yep. But you are protected here, collective. You could be a high priestess I'm talking to. There's somebody that's a, that is very controlling here with the King of Wands energy here. This could be a leader, somebody who's very strong, stern. But this person is not the truth with the Ace of Swords in the reverse. Yeah, somebody is going through, is your person is going through a bunch of regret dealing with this controlling ass person. Yep. They didn't see the they didn't see this person for who they was. So they could have went back and took an offer from this person. They didn't see this person as the devil as they were. So that's why they're going through karma now because they had the opportunity to walk away from the devil, but they chose not to walk away from the devil. They took this offer again and goddamn got played again. They went through a whole nother damn uh, another cycle with somebody using magic on them. Told you. Magician. Judgment has been called on this situation. This situation is over with. Damn. You got to have strength to walk away from this shit, man. Whoever I'm talking to. Now they busy in the community fighting here. Let me get these cards up and we're gonna get some more. I think I basically just summed that up. We're gonna we're just gonna get some love messages and we're gonna move on after this energy. Let's go to, sorry guys, I just want to put these up real quick, it's over here, 
All right, so now we we are we are getting messages from the hidden oracle, hidden the hidden truth oracle deck. So we're gonna get a couple messages before we end this reading out. Let's get out this energy. Yes, I hope that you can forgive me one day is who I'm talking to, whoever I'm talking to. You guys know where these messages go. I don't know your situation until you get a personalized reading with me, okay? These are general messages. Please take what resonates and disregard the rest. Somebody is uh, saying that they're starting to understand this connection now. Your person is saying, we both know I am not the one for you. So this could be karmic energy. They talking, who they talking to. So many things remind them of you. You could have left them when you seen them with someone or they could have left that other karmic because they seen that other karmic with someone. Hmm. Somebody loves you unconditionally. There's an energy that loves you unconditionally. Hmm. That damn tuna sandwich was good, y'all. <laughs> I was just reaching up and getting... <laughs> You are becoming a better person because of they, so they are saying that you are making them become a better person. My life is not together as it seems. Yeah, they trying to get their life back in order because it's in disarray right now, especially messing with this damn demonic ass demon. Um, that's they they are bounded to the fucking devil. They bounded to obsessions and um uh narcissistic ways right now. They're um tied to this this uh, succubus, incubus, demon right now, whether it's masculine or feminine, yeah. This person feel like you're leaving them behind. This person wish that things could be different. Your person saying, sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Your person said, said that they hid who they really were from you. Your person saying, finding out the truth crushed me. So they could have found out some truth about this karmic is what I'm picking up. And all this, I feel like that they feel what they feel for you, but they also was in love with this karmic. So I feel like that they are exemplifying both feelings for you and this karmic. So even though they was going through some type of family disruption, but finding out what happened, like really catching somebody in the act, that's a whole different, like, damn, I would feel crushed too. Like, oh my God. How could you? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but shit happens. What what goes around comes around. <laughs> what goes up comes down. What you do to people will come back to you ten times fold. Watch what you do. Because <laughs> God is watching. The ancestors is lurking. And got my back like Cairo Prague. Got the <laughs> my collective back like we ain't going out of whack. <laughs> I'm so stupid. I'm so corny. We ain't going out of style. We ain't going out of whack. What the fuck that come from? But anyway, let's go, y'all. <laughs> I know that I crossed the line with you. This person is saying that they that they know that they crossed the line with you. We ain't going out of no whack. We ain't no whack. <laughs> I don't know what baby say that. Uh, I got to work on my freestyling skills, y'all. I'm still working at it. Yeah, you speak to this person through music. Somebody is afraid to contact you. This person is afraid to contact you, but they replay y'all conversations over and over again. This person can't stop thinking about you. And this person does not react when people mention your name. So this let me know that people are still talking about you. This other individual may be even talking about you. This other karmic energy may be even talking about you. Or fa family, friends may be still talking about you. But they still got your name in their mouth. Um, your person is acting like they're not moved by the situation when they really are. They are in love with you. They do not want to be with this karmic. So they're going through a bunch of uh, upheavals right now. And those are the messages that I have for you guys. Um, if you like my style, if you like my vibe, hit me up. I'm your girl, the neighborhood guru. Come through. Fuck with your girl. Love you. Love you guys. Send you nothing but healing energy. Namaste. Ashe. Amen.